Hey everybody, if you're looking to get into any type of service business, this is a really good and suitable quote by Milton Berle. If opportunity doesn't knock, build a door. And that's the way things should be. You just got to go after it. Don't sit back and wait for someone to come knocking at your door. Create your own door and start your own business. You'll see in the background today, I've got various spots, ink spots. I've got five carpeted rooms. I've got a carpeted staircase. I've got these floors, which I always take before pictures. I didn't know if those were scratches from somebody else, but I think it's part of the texture of the wood. But anyway, um, today I'm doing, like I said, carpets, laminate wood floors, and three bathrooms, tile, and grout. So I'm basically doing all of the flooring in this home. Somebody is moving into it, and they wanted everything to be done. And this is the type of customers that you want to go after if you want to start a carpet cleaning, uh, tile, and wood cleaning business. And also, I'm doing upholstery, I might add. You'll see a small sofa and love seat. So I'm doing all of the flooring plus a sofa and love seat. And as far as the wood f laminate flooring is just, like I said, a general cleaning. So the price is really fair. You know, not a whole lot of work going into it. And then the bathrooms, I priced those out. You'll see, I'll show you my invoice or my work order so you could see what I charged for all of this. I don't normally do that, but for those new people that are getting into business, you can see pretty easy job. I mean, it took me four hours to do the entire, uh, all the floors and the furniture. So I think I'm making a little over $200 per hour. You could see how beautiful the floors came out. This is the lower, lower level in the hallway. And then the tile also came out absolutely beautiful. My wife was helping me on a couple of these bathrooms. We kind of worked together to get things going. This is the after photo. There she is kind of wiping down the grout lines. But we did discover a trick on this particular grout. We used, who knew, soft scrub. <laughs> and I did use the drill. I forgot my grout uh, brush that's usually on the end of a pole. So there you go, soft scrub. It did have bleach. It worked absolutely amazing. Definitely recommend that on the grout lines. And then here you go. This is me just kind of going over it with the cleaner. And then I'm going to go over it with a glad pad and the orc. Just polish it clean. And you could see it polished up absolutely beautiful. And I always do a collage, just a pick collage. So you can send that to the client when you're done if they're not there. Here's a copy of what I texted her. And then called for the payment. And here you go. I won't do this very often. I'm hiding the customer's name on the top, but you could see today's date. This was my second job of the day, 11 a.m. I originally quoted her 325 for just the carpets, and then we discussed over the phone the tile, the wood, and the upholstery. So there's the breakdown for each item. $819 was the total bill for four hours work, looking at about a little more than $200 an hour. So there you go. If you want to get into the business, build that door and go after it.